Graffiti, to me, I would like to say that it's not... I don't really like the word graffiti because it has negative connotations with it. And I feel like, to me, it should be called art in general. What I do and what I've seen people do is art. And yes, there's graffiti, I suppose, and some people just deface things, but there's a large percentage of the population of the people who do graffiti that's art, and I think it deserves to be called art. What really got me into that kind of drawing style or painting style initially was my one of my sister's ex-boyfriends. That's kind of weird, but he was really into that, and I kind of looked up to him, and I liked art, and I always have, and I always love drawing, and he just showed me a new way that I could express myself, and I pretty much fell in love after that, so ever since then, my art has been heavily influenced by what people would call graffiti. I think that certain things, it's kind of a gray area, I think. I think that some people, what some people do is definitely art, and I believe that they deserve every right to express themselves. But at the same time, where do you draw the line between what's art and what's not? I mean, sometimes it's clear when somebody's being artistic and somebody's just defacing property. So it's kind of, like I said earlier, a gray area. But I think that it's art, and I think people should be able to express themselves how they would like to makes me feel like some people aren't getting the credit that they deserve. On the same note, it makes me feel that some people are also giving a bad name to the artists who really are just trying to express themselves. And honestly, I think it's a way that it's, it keeps people from doing other possibly more negative things, I suppose. If you look at it from an outside perspective, someone who doesn't understand what they're doing, doesn't understand graffiti and the whole you know, lifestyle and concept, they're gonna look at it as a bad thing in general. But if you look at it from the eyes of the artist, a true artist, then you can see really how it's helping them develop as a person and they're getting so much inspiration from the world around them and I, think, I just think it's a beautiful thing that people deserve to be able to do. As an urban photographer, I feel like that by me capturing an image, it tells a lot of the story, where we're from, how we live, how we have evolved in life. And I don't think graffiti should be a crime. I think some people should be given the opportunity to show how they feel. Yeah, I have friends that are, are um, I guess you can say graffiti artists. You know, I just like to think of them as artists. And, uh, you know, um, when people say, like, graffiti artists are wild and run around and, you know, they, they think of them as, I guess, troublemakers. I mean, this, that's, that's all they do is just that, you know, they just do graffiti or something. But, I you know, I know a lot of, I know, like, a couple of cats that, that b-boy and, you know, they have hobbies like Beyblading, playing Pokemon, and, you know, they're just normal people. I mean, I don't think art is a crime because, you know, graffiti is art. Photography is art. I do photography. Um, there's a whole bunch of stuff um, that's art. And to say uh, graffiti is a crime, you know, ain't fair because it's art.